The sponsor of my channel is Manco.Store, a place where you can buy yourself some good items, or if you have them already, you can sell them for real cash. Feel free to check it out, the link is in the description. Oh shit! <clears throat> Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy Officer Vorobsky reporting for duty. Yes, it is finally happening. Welcome to the new episode of Hacker Police! Yeah, I made you wait for, for quite a while. It's been five months since the first episode, but wait no more. Today's one, oh boy, today's one is something else. It is not only about catching a cheater, but also about his mentality. We'll have an actual psychological portrait of a person, because all his actions that have been captured by me in this video reveal Cheater's personality. And man, some people should never touch multiplayer games. I'm not gonna make you guys wait any longer, let's jump right into it. I want to start with the foreword. If you want to skip it and get to the action, you can click this, this button. But I highly recommend you to keep watching because it's pretty important. So, uh, there was a concern in the comments to my previous episode where people were pointing out that I give cheaters attention. That some cheaters don't even hide their cheats, they're being assholes and love ruining the game for others. And the fact that I put them in the video gets them publicity that they want. Listen, Officer Vorobsky is not that fucking stupid, okay? I do know that some hackers do it blandly, so everybody pays attention to them, because that's the only attention these miserable human beings get in their lives. I am aware of it. But let's have a closer look. There were two cheaters in my previous hacker police. The second guy got destroyed in my video. I completely outplayed and outsmarted him and made him play my game, which got him pretty angry. Now I want to ask a question. If you were him, would you be happy to get shit on even when you hack? When there's someone that's playing so much better than you even though you use aimbot, wall hacks, crit hacks, but nothing helps you because you're that fucking bad. And then in the end you accuse someone of hacking when you hack yourself, which shows how much of a hypocrite and a moron you are. Would you really want this type of attention? I don't think so. Moving on to that other cheater, which is the cringy Your Soul Is Mine kid. Now, he didn't try to hide his hacks, he was pop stomping, being an asshole, and was uh, really enjoying it. I added him into the video just because he was the second hacking soldier on the same server. He was not even the star of that episode, he was just a, just a little addition. But yeah, I gave him attention and he didn't even seem to care much first, but just about a week ago, he appeared on my Discord server. Uh, the link is in the description, by the way. And these are his messages. He starts off pretty chill and shit, but then drops this message in the main chat. He pings everyone, even though it obviously does not work. So, I will get to the point. Vorofuck harass me for some stupid no one gives a fuck hacker police video for milking views. You motherfuckers spammed me in my Steam account for no reason. Seriously, you. I don't give a fuck n Hey Vorabey, I will send- <laughs> I will send my boys. Hey Moz, be ready for tomorrow. N I really love how he doubles on that M word just to show how serious and tough he is. Well, first off, I did not harass you in that video. I only pointed out that you were hacking and I made fun of that. If this is harassment to you, then there's no sense in trying to act tough. It looks retarded. A stupid no one gives a fuck hacker police video. Uh, this is not true. Everybody gives a fuck about this video. This video was the reason my channel started growing at the first place and all of my subs were waiting for today's second episode for months. Spammed in my Steam account for no reason. For no reason? <laughs> what are you talking about? You are a hacker and you would not believe it, but people hate hackers in computer games. I don't give a fuck, n-word. This is also not true. If you didn't care, you wouldn't get into my Discord five months after I uploaded a video with you. So you do care. I'm not sure what, what point you're trying to make here. And I really love this one. I will send my boys. Yeah, the raid never happened and um, I'm pretty disappointed. If those two accounts that got instantly banned were your boys, this is not raiding, <laughs> it's dog shit. As you can see, this guy is very upset so much time later, and the first guy that I was talking about previously, both of his accounts got back banned, so what can I say? Hacker police works perfectly, bitch. So to sum all of this up, making a video with crying over hacker and making a video where this hacker is getting fucked is two different things. This is not the type of attention these idiots want. Now that I made this clear, we can finally move to the new case. Let's go. Everything started on a day when I was trying to record a different video, but my neighbor said, nah, we were gonna start repairing something, it was <laughs> it was way too loud, so I decided to simply chill on a random high tower server. So I'm playing some random community high tower, 
And the reason I decided to start recording this video is because there is a really toxic guy in the enemy team. This one. He's really angry about dying from anyone. Especially from me, if I drop the easy right there. He's probably gonna reply. He's gonna report me, apparently. <laughs> Why do you report me? I'm just asking. I'm wondering. I got him like two times. He got me once and said easy. I mean, we can have some fun with this guy right here, am I right? There he is. Easy. I gotta turn down the volume a bit because these people seem to be too loud. What the fuck is wrong about all these reports that people are <laughs> dropping? <laughs> Okay. So basically, as you can see, it's a classic Quoki Scout that is getting too upset about dying. He already reported me for <laughs> whatever reason, and he called a different scout on the server a hacker. It's not really in the video, because it happened before I started recording. My idea was to keep doing what I was doing, killing him, taunting, and saying easy. Just one more time of me killing him, and that's gonna be a domination. Oh, fuck. I should not fuck this up. We're so close. I just wonder what he's gonna say. There he is. Let's play with the health pack. Oh shit, never mind. I dodged that. Two shot it again. I don't know. It's just like all the shots are connecting on this guy. He's eating all the scatters. Just like fucking cereal. The only thing I dislike about the server, well, a few things actually, but the main thing is that it's laggy. I tried playing this lots of times, but every time I connect, it feels like my FPS drops to 30, and uh, there's nothing I can do about it. He's dead. He got two shot by another scout. <laughs> oh, is it kill streak? I'm not sure for now. Is it? Let's try to kill somebody. I'm gonna get a kill streak on this guy with his own <laughs> scatter gun. That's gonna be absolute annihilation. Nice burps, I guess. Nice cheats. Everybody's hacker. Everybody's hacking on the server. All of them. He dies to a different scout and he calls him hacking. A hacker, I mean. He dies to me, I'm a hacker, and now that sniper that headshot him, he's a hacker too. Everybody is hacking today. Maybe I don't know something. Maybe they managed to find a way to hide those hacks from me. Maybe I don't see something that he sees. He's a soldier now. Well, not a chance then. Oh, quick switch soldier. He might have a chance with that one. Did he disconnect? Not yet. He's been playing here for a while as well. 349 points. I stopped seeing him at all. Oh, he's on top. But first I wanna... I'm not gonna kill the sniper. Yeah, fast respawn. There he goes. He gets me with the random crit and taunts! And drops easy trash report. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Can anybody tell me? I'm genuinely wondering. Yeah. That sound in the background is the is the only reason why I'm not recording a different video today. I was about to record something else, you know. Cheater. Well. How am I cheating? You're dying too fast does not mean that everybody hacks, which kind of makes sense. Maybe you got, gotta play better. Easy rage. <laughs> That's rage, yeah. Dude, these fucking neighbors, I swear to god. Are they fixing something every fucking year? Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Go MG. 
You're gonna cry. He wants to MG. You're bottom Russian. You are not Vara Bay. N word. Here I need to clarify some things for those who have no idea what he's talking about. He calls me out for MG. MG is a 1v1 game format where you don't have any health packs on the map. You can only move and shoot. And first to get 20 kills wins. It's just a practice map for improving your aim and movement. Nothing more than this. Uh, bottom Russian. The reason he knows I'm Russian is because whenever someone joins to a server, it shows their location in the chat. And bottom means a low division player in competitive TF2. Uh, the lowest possible division is open and he tries to use this as an insult. What I don't get though is why he mentioned Varabey. I was playing from uh, my fake account and as you'll figure out later in the video, he had no idea it was me. I am still trying to understand what he meant by saying all of this because first he called me bottom Russian trash and then he says that I'm not Varabey. Uh, maybe he's a fan of mine, which uh, would have been amazing. Let's get back to the video. I actually kinda wanna know what was that all about. He said that you're not Varabey. Well, of course I'm not. I'm playing from the fake account. That's one. And second of all, <laughs> I don't get the logic of his words. There he is. Nah, there's another soldier with him. But he's getting attacked from behind. Easy in the chat right there. Trash Russian N word. I mean, is that the way he's trying to piss me off or something? Like that's that's fucking lame. That's the lamest shit I can possibly see in a computer game. Using N word as an insult. <laughs> Where is this kid? There he is. Well, you can leave for now. I allow it. This can't suck a dick. Oh, another one! Another mad guy on the server. Community high towers are also <laughs> pretty crisp. Just like casual. What can I say? I like it. He's spectating me. Look. <laughs> He's spectating me. Let's miss all the shots now. Let's play like absolute shit. <laughs> what is gonna say? You're done too. <laughs> what <a po> <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, brilliant, brilliant. Okay, now we're gonna play extra sus. Let's go. Let's go for it. That was <laughs> absolutely terrible. He's playing again, and this, he's playing sniper this time. Damn. Well, he offered me a third chance to enjoy dominating him again. What a kind person coming for him. And of course, rinse and repeat. Easy is the shit. Let's jump him. Worth mentioning that after he switched to Sniper, he started killing a lot more people, including me. There was also a level 3 sentry near him all the time, so I couldn't kill him that much anymore. But I had this feeling that there is something weird about the way he started playing. It's really hard to explain, but he was hitting shots that snipers don't normally hit. And I don't mean aimbot, he, he wasn't using one. I mean wall hacks. You'll see it later in the video. Wait, does he hack? Can be. He knew where I was going. He saw me. He was aiming at that direction, even though there's no way he knew I would appear there. Yeah, you gotta be hacking. It's probably a hacking. <laughs> 
Let's see. How did I know that he was hacking? Well, I didn't know for sure, but I had reasons to think so already. I switched to sniper and didn't show myself a single time, so he didn't see me playing sniper. Here, I'm trying to find him, and when I pick, he's already aiming at that exact direction. I pick him again, and guess what? He's ready to shoot me. And then I pick him for the third time from the left side of this wall. He's yet again aiming directly at me, but I quickly move to the right side, and he almost instantly headshots me. And when I say almost instantly, I mean it, it took him about 0.3 seconds to spot me and hit a headshot even though he couldn't know that I would appear from this side of the wall, which, which is kinda bullshit. But hey, maybe he just got lucky and he pre-fired, maybe it's all just a coincidence, right? Yeah, let's keep watching. Oh, get destroyed. Oh. Oh, he's a cheater. He's fucking hacking. No way, dude. No way. This mad fucking kid is a hacker as well. Is it? Is this video worth a fucking episode of Hacker Police? I'm not really sure. Hey, you got my mustache. What is wrong with him? Well, at this point you perfectly saw it all by yourselves. I switched to Spy, went invisible, and right after I picked around the corner, he pre-fired me again, while I was invisible. This right here is a dead ass proof that he's a cheater, and I was genuinely surprised, as you can tell. You know what I'm gonna do, he's met at another guy, the fuck with that, that guy. I'm gonna disguise as a sniper, hopefully I'm gonna be... Yep, yeah, I'm him. Immediate shot. Immediate one, you know, just second, like a millisecond I showed my body, he shot me. He probably thought that it was, was him. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely making a video on this guy, fuck it. There's no way he's gonna know that I'm here. <laughs> yeah, this fucking dude is hacking. <laughs> fucking trash, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he can't even out snipe our sniper with hacks, just imagine. How bad he should be. We should probably uninstall the game, bro. Honestly. You're so fucking bad. I wonder if there's any way to call admin, I suppose. This is all the gameplay that I have recorded, but it surely does not end here. It's about to get so much better. First off, I want to point out how surprised he was when he realized it was me. Nah, surprise is the wrong word. He, he fucking panicked. He thought, well, I'm fucked. I mean, look at all these nervous messages that he was spamming after I used voice chat. He instantly knew that it was over for him. A few minutes later, I disconnected from the server, went outside to chill a little bit, and when I got back, I saw him on my Discord server. Who would have thought? Gonna start with the most basic ones. Uh, he was still trying to tell that I was cheating myself, uh, that he caught me cheating on my alt. Uh, judging by this, he definitely thought that those other players on that server were also cheating. Caught you too, cheating on alt. You pay for what you did, deal with it. Okay. Get my 2300 ELO, Russian dog. And dog with caps, I love this passion. Uh, 2300 ELO is his MG score, which is not that bad. Uh, if not to mention that you're cheating and you could have easily used aimbot as well. Then he calls me a dogfucker and gets blocked by my mods. Uh, joins from another account and shit's getting more intense. Uh, you can't escape me, retard. I have 60 Discord accounts and 120 Steam accounts. Keep cry, dog shit. What's with all these dogs, man? Uh, did one bite you when you were a kid? Or does your dog keep shitting on the floor in your room? I, I don't get it. And I'm not trying to escape you. I'm instead gonna use all these messages in my video because you supplied me with them. And now moving on to the most interesting messages. Uh, he PMs me and still tries to prove that I was somehow hacking. And uh, that is a genuine question from me. Is it some kind of next level trolling I can't understand? Because at that point I thought, there is no fucking way. Th there is no way somebody acts like this, like, th this is impossible. You are real trash here, 
You can't understand because you're a Russian. Makes perfect sense. You're a bottom open player. You bad. Turn on cheats more. Just keeps on with his routine of trying to prove that I'm hacking yet again. Uh, leaves the question, you record? <laughs> Yes, I do. It's funny how you didn't say you're not cheating on alt. Classic for Russians. High cheat, blame cheaters when they cheat on alt. Very good, Vo Noob. Vo Noob is something new. Um, I'm, I'm pretty surprised that he missed an opportunity to call me a Voro Gay or Voro Bot, but instead he decides to go with this punchline, which is not really that good, but I'll take it. Later on, I found his ETF2L account. ETF2L is a site where people play competitive. And he is almost permanently banned there from playing games and also permanently banned from forums and comments. And I asked uh, a friend of mine on why he was banned from forums and he said that he was being extremely racist, which is pretty obvious. He was just being a fucking asshole, he was homophobic, he was hating on female gamers as well. Yeah, just, just terrible stuff, you know. Then he messages me from yet another Discord account of his. You can make video about me, I don't give a fuck, keep cheating on alt, uh, n-word Russian. If you want MG, you find me on online wars without cheat. No, I don't want to MG with you, because why would I want <laughs> to MG somebody who is calling me a fucking Russian n-word? This is fucking priceless, I had another look on his etf 2 account, and the guy who was calling others bottom trash players was trying to win open four times, and I said, bro, win open at least once. MG master and he replies with how can I win open if I'm banned <laughs> On this screenshot he admits that he's hacking he says I inject after switch sniper I'm gonna translate it into a human language He says that after he switched to sniper he turned the hex on which is uh, which is why I thought that there was something suspicious when he started hitting all the shots all of a sudden then he messages me <laughs> the next day and he says why I'm trash cheater explain or player I'm, I'm so fucking done with this. You are cheating on a pub server and you still suck. This is why you're trash. It, it gotta be fucking obvious. Remember something. Cheaters are even in Prem. <sighs> Premier Division is the highest division uh, in the entire competitive TF2. I'm still not gonna justify any hackers that hack in competitive TF2, but yet again, you hack on a public server against random people that maybe just started playing this fucking game. And what's with this fucking finger pointing? You're just like a fifth grader that got caught cheating in a test. But they were also cheating, but I'm getting punished for this and not them. God damn it. You're fucking disgusting. Then I bring up the point that he's clearly trying to ignore. I say, hex aside, uh, this is the latest thing I care about even though that all started here, but you're a racist, egoistical and just ridiculous asshole. And he says, uh, wait a second, Russian, uh, no, no racist, what? <laughs> I thought I'm gonna have enough energy to comment over all of this, but <laughs> this is just beyond me. Uh, you were calling me a Russian dog, you were racist to Russians, and not only that, you were also racist to other people, as I was told, and you were accusing somebody of being racist. What the fuck? After I had enough of this bullshit, I said, let's stop this conversation, getting kinda bored. He replies, classic Russian, uh, you were a real asshole, lol. And this is pretty much it. So what do we have in the end? We have an absolute psychopath that is very inconfident because he has something to prove to random people on the internet on a random Heights Hour server. He does not see a single problem with the way he behaves. Uh, the hypocrisy levels are over the fucking top. This is, this is literally nuts. He's also very racist, extremely toxic, bad at the game, way too fucking dumb, and overall one of the most unlikable persons that you can possibly meet in the entire world of TF2. This is the definition of a guy that you should never be. Okay now, this was quite a run. This person is without exaggeration the biggest tumor of a cheater that I've ever met in this game. If you have any stories of yours or maybe you've seen uh, some hacker that is worse than this, I generally will read your comments, so make sure to leave it. And don't forget to like this video and of course subscribe to my channel for more weekly content. Hopefully this episode was worth the wait. It was me, Officer Verovsky. Have a great day everybody and see you in the next episode of Hacker Police. Bye.